You know what making that last video made me realize is that I don't really think I've ever been an atheist. I don't think I really ever have been. I've tried. I've tried really hard. But I don't think I've ever actually been there. I've never really fully been able to give that feeling, that connection that I talk about up. And when I did, I was at the lowest point in my life. I was in a downward spiral I almost didn't recover from. And uh, so for me there's, there's a lot attached to this feeling, this connectedness. For me, it's, well, I mean, like I kind of said in the last video, I, I just, I, 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 I lose the will to live without it. And uh, if you think that's sad, then whatever, whatever. It makes my life fulfilled. It makes me feel like I have a purpose. Whether I really do in reality or not, whatever. It makes me feel like I do. And I'm just, I guess I'm just not willing to give that up. And I don't think I ever was. Even though I considered myself agnostic slash atheist since you know, 19, 20 years old. But you know, I, I, I think back at it and it's, you know, I, I initially kind of went kind of pagan for a while, but never really believed the folklore or whatever you call it, the, the, the stories, all the anthropomorphic stories. I've never, you know, I've always, I think I've always had a hard time with the whole, the whole anthropomorphic God thing, except when I was actually completely indoctrinated when I was like uh, Flanders kids, when I was you know, an early teenager and, and, and younger. Um, I mean, I was like Flanders kids. I looked like them. I acted like them. Um, and look, looked. Um, so, I mean, I broke out of that part of it, but... Uh, I don't think I've ever quite talked about how indoctrinated I was as a kid. Um... I remember this one time there was a, in fourth grade, or was it fifth grade? I think it was fifth grade. I, uh, one of my good friends, I had, uh, went over to his house and I said, uh, you know, we were talking and just about the different things and he, I said, did you promise you won't tell? And he, and he goes, what? You, you promise? Well, yeah, sure. Fuck. And he was like, what? What were you going to say? I just said it. That's kind of how it went. I... I thought something would bad would happen to me if I said a swear word. I was just so, so, so indoctrinated. It's, it's... I was afraid of everything. I, I... <laughs> So, you can look at me how you want. Maybe you'll say, oh, you're not strong enough to handle atheism. Well, if that's the case, then fine. That's fine. My life is much happier now. And I feel like I have a purpose. Whether you agree or not, I don't give a shit. I'm gonna enjoy my life.